Hello YouTube and welcome to the Doctor's Archives New Year's Special. So let's get into a spoiler review because that's what I've been doing so far for this series. There is a narration at start at the start. The Dalek is split into three and buried around the world. Only one part wasn't buried due to the person's death. This episode is set on New Year's 2019 as the character actually says she hates working on New Year's. Yet, the, per the actor Mandip Gill who plays Yaz said they didn't know when the episode was actually set. And so I didn't know when it was going to air. Yet clearly it was New Year's because it actually everything pointed towards New Year's with the setup of the episode. The bits of the Dalek are reacting to each other to the point where they reformed a squid. The Doctor and crew are watching cosmic fireworks. They travelled. They have travelled to see lots of New Year's fireworks. So another hint that it was a New Year's episode originally. This episode is taking place in Sheffield. There is no opening theme for the episode. That like the first episode, pretty much. Um, the Dalek is in squid form. I also known as this flesh form inside the metal shell. <clears throat> the doctor destroys furniture in Graham's house. While the doctor thinks the doorbell is an intruder alarm. We see Ryan's dad and a doc and a doctor is giving um gives him a talking to about being a Basically a deadbeat father. Graham gave a great speech to Ryan's deadbeat dad. The Dalek is on the woman, Lynn I believe her name was, from the excavation site and is controlling her. There is a car chase in the episode. The Dalek is using the human, the human host, Lin, to get what it wants. I don't like Ryan's father. I have a sense something is going to happen to him. And I'll get to it a little bit later on. Ryan is resentful towards his father. Ryan's father gives a speech to Ryan telling him what he thinks he did. The three people who split the Dalek were known as custodians. The TARDIS systems were blown but were reset so it didn't so no new TARDIS next series. The Dalek is the first to leave the Dalek is the first to leave Sky. This type of Dalek is the first to leave Sky, I should say. The Daleks can laugh. They leave. They left Graham behind to have a good scene with Wine's father. Unit was mentioned, and so is Kate Stewart. But when Doctor called the hotline, she got to Homeland Security, and she said that unit operations have been put on hold due to international funding. So maybe in series 12 we'll see Unit again, or Kate Stewart, or something that will bring back Unit. Lynn is fighting the Dalek Squid. Me and a Dalek, it's personal. The Doctor. 
the Dalek has a show, and it's a new design. The Daleks can now fly. Don't let Wayne's father into Titus, even though he's allowed, because I still didn't trust him. The army won't be able to destroy the Dalek or drone, as they call it. The Dalek is shutting down all communications within Britain to send off a signal. There was a scene of a family that said everything, noticed that everything was down, including Wi Fi, Netflix, and all that, and phone communications. And they said that they would have to have a conversation. <laughs> and it felt like that there was so much dread in having a conversation that it was actually quite funny. I definitely recommend watching this episode because of that one scene. And here's the final thing. Thought something would happen to Wayne's father, and it did. He got taken over by the Dalek. He then almost got sucked out with the Dalek squid into a sun that was going supernova. But Wayne saves him. And it was a great episode. I cannot wait for series 12 next year. You heard me right. No new Doctor Who this year. It's only in 2020. Thanks for watching and goodbye.